Hello, my name is Noemi Klaus and today I want to explain you a little bit more about 5G. Um, 5G and older uh, connection technology. And uh, thanks to that, that uh, I'm also the dancer when I was thinking about it. Uh, I have one idea how to explain you that uh, to show and to feel and to make you remember. Uh, but firstly, I will tell that it's not for experts. It's mostly for people who just don't know why we should choose this or this uh, technology, why 5G could be good or maybe it's completely not. Uh, of course, there are also people who are scared of 5G, but I don't go uh, into this topic. Uh, but yes, uh, I will try to explain you that on the, the example of dancer. Mm. In dance, in couple, you have leader and follower. Leader is mostly man and following, follower is mostly woman. Uh, but yeah, sometimes it's different, but I don't go uh, into this topic. <laughs> and uh, how it works. Man, so leader, uh, will tell that it's maybe machine, maybe software, something, which can, uh, something what have the data uh, which want to send them and follower uh, is connectivity it can be lte 4g 5g um, wi-fi just 5g and older one i will uh, take this part <laughs> yes and uh, how it works mm, the most important thing uh, in 5G and the difference between 5G and older technology is latency. Um, with 5G we can say, send the data in the really short time, uh, or really short latency. Mm, and to example, yes, of dancer. Uh, if we have the leader, he will lead some part of body and uh, when we have a really good follower, so this is our 5G, yes? Uh, if we have a really good follower, the answer will be immediate. We have leading and following. It's just almost real time. But if we have the basic uh, follower, the latency time will be much, much, uh, much, much bigger. For example, there is the leading and following yes it's not immediate we need time to uh, to have this reaction so this is the latency and the second thing is amount of data uh, if we have this leader so uh, our machine uh, machine or um, yeah, software uh, we want to send a lot a lot of data and we have follower which will send us this data. Uh, and uh, if the follower is basic, it will be able to answer just one part. For example, we are leading the chest, we are leading uh, hands, yes, we are leading hips, we are leading um, any part of body, but the follower will be able to answer just one or two won't be able to, to answer at the same time all of this leading. But with 5G, so our uh, yeah, very, 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 uh, very good follower um, will be able to answer all of this leading at the same time. So it's exactly with the 5G. Uh, if we have huge amount of data, we want to send it, we are able to do it through the 5G because it's able to, to send this all data in the, as I told before, in the almost real time. So yes, uh, this is about 5G. Of course, there are much more differences and benefits. For example, um, for example, security, yes, uh, 5G is much more secure. So, uh, so this is uh, other benefit, but yeah, I wanted to focus on this uh, two main one. And yes, now <laughs> you can remember that 5G is a really good follower and lower technology is basic follower or intermediate, yes? <laughs> so if you need huge amount of data in almost real time to send, 
you for sure need 5G. Thank you. Bye.